to Shoot the Anime Show's Road. Today is an unboxing video. As you see, here we have the Nintendo Switch OLED, and then this is the case. This is the eShop for 12 months member free membership, and then this is the 128 gigabyte SanDisk Nintendo Switch memory card. So as you see here, we're going to unbox this. So let's take this out of the box. So let's take the Joy-Cons. So let's take out the Joy-Cons. Actually, I like the texture of it. It's good. So here's the left Joy-Con and here's the right Joy-Con. Then now let's take out the Switch OLED. So here, as we see, we're going to take out the Switch OLED. This is where you put the game card. There's a slot to put it in. And then these are the volume buttons, and this is to turn the switch on and off. And of course, there's a little kickstand in the back. So it can be adjusted like this or this. So I think this is very useful. And overall, the screen size is 7 inches, and it's pretty big. So here I'm going to connect the Joy-Cons with the OLED. So let's see which side is left and which side is right. I think this is left. So, so here as you see, I connected both of the Joy-Cons. So here I'm going to set it up on the side. And now if you open this flap, you have a manual. So this is how it looks like. It has the Nintendo Switch symbol and it comes in I think three or four different languages. So it looks like this. It just says things that you need to be uh, caution of and the usual. So here I'm going to take out these. So Let's explore what's in this. So, this is the dock. So, you have to use this for the TV mode. I'll show you more. So, this is the dock. I like the color pretty much and the texture of it. So, in the back of it, could just I think pop it out yeah you could take that out and then and then this is the AC adapter okay like this is the AC this is where you put the AC adapter and this is where you put the HDMI cable this is where you put the internet cable these are the things and then you have to put like the switch in here like this and then you have to be careful how you put it because sometimes if you put it like so fast you see these edges it could scratch your switch and keep these aside so i forgot so when you take this kickstand off here you could see the micro SD card slot. So they give me this card, this micro SD card. You could just put it in. Um, This is 128 gigabytes, but usually it is not sold with the Nintendo Switch OLED. You have to buy it separately. So cause I got in bundle from Costco, it gave me this in the bundle. So you just pop, pop it in. Yeah. Okay. And let's close it, and then I'll put the I'll put it right aside here. 
and this is the adapter cable for the so this is the adapter cable for the Nintendo Switch like the charger for it plus the Nintendo Switch is in type C here you can see I just look and I'll keep that aside too and this is this is the HDMI cable. So this is the HDMI cable. And, and then here we have the Joy-Con straps. So these are the Joy-Con straps. So see. Now let's try it on. So plus to add on something, this is how you take the Joy-Cons in the OLED switch. Okay, now you could put it on this. No, this is, the, yeah, this is the minus. Yeah, see, so. So it says lock, like you could lock it like by doing this and other one. So, well, so you could use it when you do it as a tabletop mode or as a TV mode. Like this, it is, it is good. Now let's take it out. You can't remove it until you unlock it. If you lock it, you can't remove it how much you try. But if you unlock it, you can like easily take it off like that. Let's see what So this is the controller for the Nintendo Switch. So for this controller, you could buy another Nintendo Pro controller or a Nintendo controller for 50 to 60 bucks. But this one includes with the set. So let's try this on. Probably. Uh, so like this. Now let's take it off. Now so let's do the setup. I'm gonna on this first. So here, as it says in Nintendo, this is the Nintendo symbol. Ah, look at that. See. So I'm gonna click English. So here, I'm gonna click English. It says for A for okay. So I click A. Now oh, it's asking me which country I'm in. I wanna put America. Then accept. Next. Searching for the networks. So here I connected to the network. Now it's asking me what like state time zone I'm in. Plus it has a touch screen. So So as you see, my time zone is UTC minus five. It doesn't show the state here. So I'm just gonna click Chicago. And it's asking me, do I wanna play in a larger screen? I wanna put later. And then it says, take out the joy cons and then put it back in. I'll show you guys how to take out the joy cons. So you have to click the black dot right over here like now take it out and then it's say
So telling me to click next, like having the joy cons like this. Next, okay. Then, so you have to add a user for this console. So I'm gonna click a new user. It's I can read a solitaire icon. I'm gonna click the Mario one because I like Mario. So it's asking me to put a nickname here. So here I'm gonna put my name. So for the nickname, I'm gonna put Mario and then I'm gonna click okay. So I'm gonna click okay again. If you wanna link a Nintendo account, so I'm gonna put later. It's asking me, do I need to add another account or do I want to skip? So here I'm going to put add another account for my sister. So create new user. And then here my sister is going to come and then do it. So I'm going to select to this rabbit icon for me. So I'm going to select A, which means select. And now for my nickname. As you see, I've added my nickname and I'm going to select OK. So now I don't want to link a Nintendo account right now, so I'm going to select. So now there's another feature in this Nintendo Switch. So over here, you see this square button. If you press it, it's the capture button. So it will capture your screen and save it. So now I'm going to select skip. And so now let's select next. We're gonna select the configure parental controls where your parent can control how many hours you uh, use the Nintendo Switch. And then it says setup is complete. Select the home button. So right now I don't have a game, but still I have the Nintendo eShop, which is my sister is going to explain right now. This bundle also includes a 12-month family membership. Here you can access online games, and these are the things that are included in this package. Here it has steps to redeem your code and stuff. Now, we also have a case included in the bundle. It's supposed to hold the Nintendo OLED so let's open this. So this is the protection kit. I'm gonna open this. So here we have a nice little pouch with a zip over here. And then we have a Velcro compartment as well. In these compartments, you can fit your games and now let's open the zip. Inside the zip is a cloth to clean your Nintendo Switch in case it gets dirty or has too many fingerprints on the screen. Um, there's also the screen protector included. Here it also has the steps needed to put the screen protector on your Nintendo. So this is the screen protector. So now here I have my Nintendo Switch. So let's open this Velcro, flip back this, and then place our Nintendo Switch here. As you see, this case is really nice and it fits the Nintendo OLED perfectly. So now we're gonna put this back in. Here you can store all your games. You can store 10 games in this pouch. So now let's close this. The case is really nice and is durable as well.